Cost of insulin skyrocketing in recent years. New bipartisan investigation out of the U.S. Senate showing it's because of dealings between insulin manufacturers and companies that control its distribution. The two-year investigation showing that manufacturers, quote, aggressively raised the list price of their leading insulin brands an average of 300 percent over the last decade. This is no surprise whatsoever to pharmacists. It limits you as the patient from having the drug that is best for you. What you're getting is the drug that the largest money is being exchanged in the background. In the last few months, the average retail price of insulin has gone down slightly. Last year, Indianapolis-based Eli Lilly announced it would cap insulin cost at $35 per month during the pandemic.